with Will Reichert. I apologize. Texting Jordan because he's not here yet. Go ahead. We'll start with. Uh, hey, Will, just um, what's it like having all the specialists back, whether it's punter, holder, snapper, everybody's back from last year? Um, I think it's awesome. Um, I think uh, over the off season we're allowed to grow together and uh, continue to work on our chemistry. And I think we've improved a lot as far as like operation and just punting and kicking in general, just because we've been allowed to be around each other and uh, build a greater bond. So I think it's been really cool. And um, I'm really excited for the season. James said he, uh, he taught y'all how to ca uh, camp in the outback. What What is that about? And then what, how much progression have you seen in, from him as a punter? Um, you know, he's just kind of a joke because he's from Australia. And, you know, actually when he first came over here, he didn't really know what outback was. So it's just kind of a joke, but um yeah, no, I think he's done really well. I think um, I think he's primed for a breakout year. I think he's going to do outstanding this year. I've seen him work this offseason. You know, it's kind of hard for guys like that to come over and you know play in the first football game only a month after they've been here. So um, I think that was kind of hard on him, but I think he's made a lot of progress and he's going to do really well this year. How do you track progress and improvement as a kicker year over year? Um, for me... Um, like I'll take videos of like my form as far as like form wise, take a lot of videos on that. And you can kind of see like, you know, over the years, like how you've how your form has gotten better and what you need to improve on. And then as far as just like making kicks, um, we do a lot of charting. So we'll go out, hit 15 balls and, you know, put where it went through in the uprights. And you can kind of, you know, tell, you know, if you even if you're making your kicks, are, are they going more towards the left, the uprights, more to the right? So we kind of study those things as well. Over here with Charlie. We asked you about Coach Hutzler in the spring, but now you've had more time with him. I think Coach Saban recently said that he really likes his enthusiasm. Just what's it been like working with him more time? Um, he's been awesome. Like like you just said, um, he has, brings a lot of energy to the room. Um, you know, not with us as well, but also with just all the special teams units, um, like in our meetings and stuff, very enthusiastic. Um, keeps everybody engaged. So I think he's going to be really good for us this year um, on special teams and as our specialist group as well. You talked about that adjustment with, with James. Just what, what are some of the things you guys did to kind of help him kind of get used to being here and getting used to playing football and everything? Like, how was that adjustment period right. last year? You know, I think like, you know, number one for him was just like getting used to like people rushing, you know, like when they play it, I was showing football over there. Like it's a lot bigger field. You're not having like a bunch of real like guys coming to rush on you. So that was one thing, I think. And then really just like getting used to, you know, making friendships, being comfortable of just like living here and, you know, going through what we go through as football players, I think was a big adjustment for him. But, um, you know, he's had a lot of time to get used to it, and I think he's, you know, thriving right now in camp. So the left side with Michael, your time here, what would you say the hardest kick that you've made? Um, that's a hard question. I mean, I don't really think of it as that. Um, I don't really, like, go out and say, oh, my gosh, this is a hard kick. I kind of just, you know, every kick's the same. You know, you're supposed to kick the same, you know, your kick at – 100% every single time. And, you know, if, if you're kicking an extra point or you're kicking a 55 yarder, it's supposed to be the same exact kick. So, um, you know, there'll be times when I watch film, even on an extra point, and I'll say, hey, you know, that wasn't my best kick. Even though it's an extra point that went in, like, still analyzing on what you can do better um, every single kick, whether it's an extra point or a field goal. There's a video going around on social media about Justin Tucker. Every time he goes up for a kick, he like studies dimples on the ball, and that's where he want to put. That's where he wants to put his foot, and it's very, very technical. But is is that something that you're doing, or do you have something just as technical as that when you're kicking? Um, I mean, kicking's very technical. I think you know Justin Tucker's one, of, you know, probably the best kicker of all time. Um, him and Adam Vinatieri are right up there. But um, you know, once you get to that like level of professionalism, you're looking at every single detail that you can to push yourself to be better. So, I mean, I don't technically look at the dimples of the ball, but there's definitely a lot of things I can that I look at uh, to help me get better. So it looked like you were in the barbershop with Michael Phelps when he came to campus. Just what did you take away from that experience and and what did you gain from the speech he gave to you guys? Um I think it was really, really cool. I mean you're talking about someone who's, you know, the greatest Olympic athlete ever. I mean I grew up watching the Olympics, grew up watching him compete. Um, you know, just the competitor that he was, um, he was relentless. He was going to keep working until he was the best of the best and he wasn't going to take no for an answer. Um, you know, I think that resonated with me, um, and a lot of my teammates that, you know, although camp is hard and, you know, we go through a lot of hard stuff, 
if you really want to be the best, you got to keep pushing. You got to, you know, how bad do you really want it? It's kind of what I took from it. So anything else? All right, Will. Thanks for your time. We'll be back.